So you guys know my name is Renee. Uh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, I'm going to just like shout-ish, like quietly, but not really, your name on three and introduce yourself to me just so that we do it in my head. One, two, three. Perfect. I understood and retained all of that. I got all of that, you guys. Great. Um, okay. So, yeah. So it's like my second day out here. <laughs> Woo! Um, I like it so far. It rains here. You guys know this. Yeah, have you used, huh? Yeah, it's cold as fuck. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, but it's cute though. It's cute. But I can't. I like can't. I like don't have a um, passport. It's like this whole thing. They just let me in. I was like, please, can I come? And they're like, yeah. Sure, you seem like you need something. <laughs> she's blonde, she's stupid, let her go! <laughs> yeah, um, so obviously, maybe not obviously, maybe that was kind of head-ass, but I just released my first project ever. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so fucking exciting. <laughs> <laughs> um, and we're gonna, you know, sing and play um, some songs off of that project for you today, but in like a very stripped back version, which is actually so much more fucking fun for me, yeah, because I, contrary to popular belief, this might be, might be like, oh my god, you shout all the time. I actually like singing softer so much more than I do quieter. Or, okay, fuck me. Softer <laughs> than I do louder. It's just more fun, and it feels like I can do whatever I want. Um, not that I couldn't if I sang louder, but like, I feel like I have free reign. So we're just gonna fucking start there. Sound good? Yeah. yeah. Okay, again, that was an ass response. Sound good? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, tight. All right, um, we're starting with uh, Colorado. <laughs> Like, I, I did like um, smaller 
like, fuck, I just had a stroke. I did, um, smaller, <laughs> did like, smaller venues on my first little, like, tour, and I think this is so much more fun. Yeah, Don't yeah, tell yeah. anybody. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, it's fine. You can tell everyone. Uh, I don't keep secrets. People are like, this is safe in this space. I'm like, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> like, I broadcast everything. Tell everybody everything. Um, so, yeah, this uh, second song I wrote for my mother. Oh, my mother. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Everybody give it up for Denise. We love you. <laughs> Shit today. <laughs> um, but yeah, this song is called Don't Tell My Mom. Y'all are tall as fuck. <laughs> Except for one person who I see is like, ah, yay! <laughs> um, are people generally, fuck me, are people generally tall here in Europe? Is that, no, you guys are short? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. heard. All right, so never fucking mind. <laughs> <laughs> my height. Uh, um, okay, well, that was depressing. Let's do the next song that's infinitely okay. fucking worse. Um, this is in the kitchen. <laughs> songs I'm like I do but I don't want to <laughs> I skipped therapy for this so did I so did I she was like are you coming I was like no 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 ma'am yeah. no, like, I have a different type of therapy yeah. I have a group therapy session I like your shirt that's so cute this shirt says strangers to lovers to enemies on it it's very cute it's very cute I don't have a t-shirt that says strangers to lovers to enemies on it so I'm gonna <laughs> That was a soft, like, oh my god, I don't have that. <laughs> Are you kidding? Do you want me to have Okay, amazing. I did just want to make sure, like, consensually. Thank god that I have this oh my now. Um, <laughs> Great, I'll sleep in it tonight. <laughs> oh, yeah, the person whose shirt I sleep in is going to be pissed. They're going to be like, what is that? <laughs> As I say, this is not for everyone. <gasps> oh, come on. Foul. Wait, that's nice. I should have been saying that shit as opposed to I am everything to everybody. Oh my god, how sad, how cute. Okay, so this oh I wear that sweatshirt. Actually my brother has it right now. Yeah, we wear it in the rap family. Um okay, so this is the last song that we're gonna do. It's my most like uplifting and yet least uplifting lyrics ever. Um but I've been so happy to be in Pali. We 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 you know the thing. Are you happy to be in Paris? We, we. Right. 
always been so fun and like exciting. I think I don't fucking know. Um, but I'm just like kind of I'm still I'm still jet lagged, but I still feel like the same way that the song does, which is just very like <laughs> middle fingers with like blindness. <laughs> This is sing world burn. You guys are so, you're just so wild. You're so creative and wild. Eventually. Okay. Uh, a, uh, no. This next one is too well. What would you be? Uh, dead. Oh! Oh! Yeah! Yeah! Honestly, even I thought that was hot. I'm gonna be honest. Okay, all right. Do you consent? Yes. Okay. What's your name? Cindy. Damn. All right. <laughs> Which artist would you like to corroborate? With? Frank Ocean. Yeah! I'm putting them all on the ground and I promise I will pick them up later. I'm not lazy <laughs> like that. My house is clean at home. Do you consent? Yeah. What's your name? Bella. Bella, come on, Bella. All right, read this for me, baby. Uh, which song from your EP is the one you think is the most intimate? Oh, the most intimate is What Can I Do? Yeah. Uh, just because I think it was like the most personal one to write, and it has. <laughs> sing it! <laughs> um, it was the most personal one to write, and it was also the first gay song that I had yes. ever written. So I feel like it was. No, no, no. I was gonna be like, oh my god, I'm gonna give it back. No, I can't skip the front row. I'm so sorry. Okay, name? Alexia. Damn, read that. <laughs> what is your favorite album of. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> um, my favorite album of 2022. Oh, this is an album. Uh, yeah. Wait, that didn't come out no, in 2023. No, no, 2023. Okay. Yeah. It was last year. No. Someone from Polydor, please don't. <laughs> it came out last year, right? No. Yeah, no. no okay, no. so I don't care. Either way, that's my favorite one, though. <laughs> um, okay, next one. Do you consent? Yeah. What's your name? Damn. Come on. <laughs> favorite song of your hippie? Oh, in the kitchen. Yeah. 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 Because every time I sing it, people <laughs> sing along, i.e., you guys. Yeah. And it makes me feel good. Because I'm like, oh my god. Good job, Renee. People give a fuck. I'm like, <laughs> Okay, do you consent? Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay, all right. Yeah. Well, uh, <laughs> among all the activities you have, actress, singer, songwriter, etc., which one allows you to express your creativity the most? Okay, so by the way, um, any other thing that I do from this point on, I will not be having anyone American read. Because <laughs> it's just not as exciting as this. <laughs> yes, cheers. Uh, I forgot the question as I was talking shit. Hang on. <laughs> oh, definitely songwriting. Definitely songwriting. Because I just feel like, okay. I feel like with songwriting, I don't have to like filter myself as much. Not that I do filter myself really on a daily. I guess you guys probably all know about this point. I fucking don't. Um, I do when I get yelled at, though. 
I get really scared and small. Like, ah, don't do that. Um, but yeah, definitely songwriting. Songwriting feels the most like intimate and the most personal and also kind of the most exciting because I get to write shit that I couldn't say. Like I can trash someone in a song. <laughs> I can't be like, fuck you, you mother better. You know what I mean? Like I can't do that online. People, would, I would get bit. And I get a lot of my videos taken down anyway. So would it be happy? Do you consent? Yes. Okay. Oh, <laughs> well, what's your name? Uh, Nalu. Damn. Amazing. I love it. Uh, how do you balance your acting and singing careers? Oh, that's actually a good question. Fun fact, um, for this entire season two filming of uh, College Girls. Uh, oh, come on, guys. Um, I, I, I feel like I genuinely did not sleep for three months. <laughs> yeah, it was crazy. And I don't recommend doing that, but I was just yeah. so excited to make music and to have like people who were supporting my music. I was like, I have to do it, you know? It just made me excited, so I was like, ah, just can't sleep. So I don't really balance it well. Not, like, not at all well, actually. Okay, do you consent? Yes. What's your name? Lola. Nice, okay. I couldn't repeat that back if I tried. Lola. Lola. Oh, just Lola? Lola. Lola. It should be the easiest. If I said Lola, would yeah. you be offended? Oh. No. Lola, what's the question, babe? <laughs> How do you manage the stress before going on stage or in your life in general? Oh, I don't really manage stress very well, actually. So, good question. Um, I think I have a lot of good people around me, which is like the best thing. Like on tour, I had all my friends with me. Like I had my best friend in the whole wide world. Like it was just like the best. I also feel like I have a really good community of you guys. So I genuinely don't manage stress. You know what I mean? Like I think like if I was worried, exactly like very those. <laughs> um, if I was worried, it would be because like I felt like I needed to do something or I needed to be something that I'm not. I feel very accepted by you guys, and I hope you all feel very accepted by each other. And if not, please keep each other in mind. Um, but I think that just makes me inherently comfortable. You know what I mean? Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay, hot. Okay, next one. This is so much fun for me. All right, baby. Consent. Yes. What's your What's your name? I do know. Amazing. Okay, read me this. <gasps> oh my God. Is this a... If I put it on right now, I'll cry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Everybody's a bully here. <laughs> okay, read me the question as I figure this out. Will you hold this? Do you mind? Yes. Okay. Uh, which song was the hardest to write, compose? Oh, amazing. Um, the hardest song to write was "What Can I Do," um, because honestly, I feel like. I feel like I, honestly, as excited as I was, uh, do I put this on a little tilt? Yeah. Will you put yeah, it on for me? Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 Okay, come on. We! 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 Okay, I will answer your question in this bright. I really fucking hope this looks good right now, and if it doesn't, <laughs> we have problems. Um, uh, definitely, what can I do? Right, it was, what, what is the hardest song to write? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, I felt like I just had a lot of homophobia and stuff, as we do, and as I still do. I'm not saying it was like a thing of the past and I'm over it. Um, but I wanted it to be very intricate, and I also wanted it to be relatable. But the biggest, like, corner was I didn't want it to, like, hyper-sexualize or, like, over-sexualize gay women. Because I think, like, a lot of times there's a whole, like, idea in, like, homophobia that, like, it's, like, predatory and, like, shitty, and I didn't want that to bleed through at all. Um, because it's <laughs> not, go figure. Um, and yeah, that was the hardest one to do. Beret, off. Oh. Oh. Guys, I don't, I don't have a head that's built for that. I just know I don't, okay? Ooh, this is cute. Okay. Do you consent? Yeah. Okay, what's your name? Vicky. Vicky Hager. Hey, baby. All right, um, what is the, oh my god, what is the question? Uh, what is your wish for 2023? Okay, uh, my wish for 2023 is I want to tour here later in the year. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. Um, I want to tour here later in the year, and I let's see what's something fun I also want to do. Speaking of which, what? We didn't need a photographer because I did this whole file for you, like it's a portfolio of my pictures, and like an introduction of myself. Come on, Paige, give it to me. I love this. Thank you, baby. That's so sweet. Thank you. Um, I hope to tour here. Come on, and you'll be my photographer. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Good. We'll be in touch, white beanie. Um, that was the question, right? 
Fire. Okay, next one, and this is going to the Strangers to Lovers to Enemy t-shirt, baby. Um, huh? What? What? Oh, you want to read one? Oh my god, you're being one-up. How do you feel right now? I'm actually shaking for you. No, you. Yeah, come and do it together. Come and do it together. Come on, camaraderie. Woo! Consent number one. Consent. Consent. Yep. Hot. <laughs> okay. All right. Name. Join up. Nice. Okay. You guys read it together and in the same cadence. Okay. Like really oh stay. In. This is huge. This is so much pressure. I'm actually. I'm gonna sweat. All right. Yep. Go. You got this. I got this. I believe in them. I believe in them. One. What inspired you to write in the kitchen? Woo! Um, okay, well, I feel like In the Kitchen is probably the most obvious one, but what inspired me specifically for In the Kitchen was um, I was listening to Camera Roll by Casey Musgraves, and I had just gotten into Casey, like just gotten in. I was like, oh, her writing is like so poetic and it's so good, and I think the world of her, yeah, like it's just, it's just so fucking smart and specific. And so I was like, well, what's my like version of a camera roll after a breakup? And for me, it was being in a kitchen and having to like cook by myself after I had cooked with somebody who I was in love with for like three years. I was like, am I just supposed to do all of this shit on my own now? It was like such a jump scare. And I absolutely was like ready to do it on my own, but I think it was just like the, the initial jarring sort of nature of being like, I, I gotta do all of this by myself and I have to learn how to do that now. And so I also wanted to make sure that it was a breakup song that didn't make somebody the victim. I e me because I was like motherfucker. One thing you're not gonna do is take away my pride. I was, like, I, was like, I was like, you can go lay. That's not happening. Anytime in the fucking world. So um, yeah, I was like, this is gonna be my like villain breakup song, but not in the way that like I'll bash your car. I'll da 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 da. It's like no no no. <laughs> I'll sit in my living room. You go sit wherever the fuck else you want to sit. I'm gonna be over. <laughs> was how I wrote in the kitchen. Um, kids, adults, that's because y'all have pretty accents. We sound like this. I'm like, hey you guys, what the fuck is up? Like, that's not fun or cute. You guys are fun and cute. <laughs> like, no, 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 I'm cute as shit. Thanks so much. Um, I, thank you, baby. Oh, this is so cute. Did you do the little ceiling? Yeah. You guys are so sweet, and this was so much fun. Um, I will hopefully be back here to do like a like a tour tour. Hey. Everybody, everybody say I love you. One two three. One two three. I love you. Okay, now everybody say we. One two three. We. we.